by the moon. several remains of the natives were uncovered. This was the first time any of us could get close to any of these violent and immense creatures. Analysis of the ice surrounding the remains proves that they have been here for well over 400,000 years. This means that they existed even before the woolly mammoth. What is even more fascinating is that they seem to have changed very little within the last hundreds of thousands of years. Like evolution is on a standstill in this world. <clears throat> we didn't expect this, and we have to conduct research around these remains. I would like properly educated staff to be added to our ranks so we can uncover the history of these violent creatures. Dr. Lisa Svensson, N527.
want to go home. It was decided that my skills was of better use at outpost N527, and I've spent a week in this... in this freaking icebox. I miss my family. It wasn't even my fault. I told them the artifacts were dangerous. Dangerous.
Do you have the key? I got it, but I have to tell you Just that... Just insert the artifact key into the tablet and hurry back here. There's something we want to show you. Science proposed by others working on the logical puzzle that is the Absolov. Now, from the beginning, I have treated this as a natural phenomena, and I will not simply believe. In time, we'll find an explanation for the Absolov's existence. And by then, I hope the fool spouting paganistic nonsense will be a long way from here. right away before this madness spirals completely out of control. I 
relax. Just relax. There's something I want to show you. Something you need to see. Sarah, you were right. Tell me, did you see him? Did you see the spirit from the machine? What the hell did you do? You, Don't you see? You killed me. You have direct access to the spirit's lair. None of us can reach it but you. You can go there anytime you want. Did you have the Jan Graper with you? Yes, You but... can even bring things with you? Oh, fantastic. I believe that the ether that you just came from is the home of the spirit from the machine. I believe that this spirit is Loki. Wait a minute, honey. You can't just assume that. We don't know. You are crazy. I've had enough of this. No, please listen to me. I am sorry Henrik did that to you. We knew perfectly fine that it wasn't going to kill you, and it wasn't like we could ask you to, to die for us. I'm not a test subject. You, you can't... Kill me for some damn experiment! I promise. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, please don't let the world end. Sarah, tell her what you told me before. Beneath the shadow of Yggdrasil, in the well of wisdom, is where the final artifact key can be recovered. In the depth, under the tree of all things. But that is not all it holds. On your way to the depth, you should be able to recover another artifact. The Eye of Odin. When you die... You have to find orbs before you can return, correct? I do. If you activate the Eye of Odin on those orbs, then you will touch them with divine magic. Then, placing them in the keyholes won't just let you pass back to Midgard. It will let you destroy the ether with a spirit left inside. We just need to find a route leading to the well. I know of one. <laughs> what? I'm, I'm sorry I didn't tell you, Sarah. Before I got in contact with you again, I found the well. When I did, I, th I thought I could fix all of this. And just like the All Father Odin, I sacrificed my eye for wisdom. Oh, Henrik. It didn't work. The route that leads to the well is underneath us, in the waste treatment plant. Scan my hand, and you'll gain access to it through the elevator. That should do it. Head down to the waste treatment plant. It should be a straight path from there. Good luck. And be careful down there. Never let the lights go out. In the worst case scenario, you always have the young ape in. Eye of Odin until the last Absolute key is inserted.